Hi everyone, my name is Julie. We are doing what I call my makeup rehab. And let's be real here. November, it's, it's the best time to shop for makeup. I know so many people are excited for spring releases. I get that. But in my world, and like what I look for in makeup, I am all about holiday releases. I am all about the sales that go on. And I am all about everything <laughs> like beauty related and all the free stuff that you can get this time of year. We've discussed before like what motivates us to purchase, especially from a brand like Ulta, which I work for. Is it multiple times the points? Is it the free gifts? Is it discounts? What do you prefer? And I learned <laughs> that I like to get two out of the three things. I like to get a discount. I like to get something for free or I like to get a discount and I get like to get multiple times the points. And November is a time where so many of those overlap. I am sure if you watch this channel, <laughs> you follow makeup trends or you at least follow certain makeup brands or you follow Ulta and Sephora. Like these words that I'm speaking to you are not foreign words. You know what I'm referring to. And Ulta's been stepping it up lately. And I'm very proud of Ulta, to be honest with you, because they're, I know they've been growing as a company and I know that COVID really like hurt the beauty industry in general. And now I'm excited to see what they're doing. And especially for the makeup lovers, for the public that wants to shop there, I have had a great time shopping and I think this will show you um, what we've been doing. And there were many things I took advantage of, many things I took advantage of this month. So let's dive into it because some of these are going to be a surprise, some of them are not going to be a surprise. Um, before I jump into the Ulta stuff, I actually want to show you, I did purchase something not from Ulta. Now it's a brand that Ulta carries, however, I found this on super, super sale and I wanted to pick it up and Stila was having like amazing sales and I think they're just getting rid of some of their products. So I want to show you the three things that I picked up. One is a smudge stick eyeliner. I got it in the shade Lionfish. This is an absolutely stunning shade. Um, it is like a warm brown shade. I like these types of shades in particular for the summer. So this one is really good. I paid $5 for it, just under. $5 like with tax. That's an amazing price. These run for $20. We still sell them at Ulta for $20, which is crazy. So I would say look around at your discount stores. Their Steeler's going through some like, I don't know if it's reformulation, but they're definitely like getting their lines down. I know Ulta does have 50% off some of their products. Um, so like take a peek and see what you can find around any like Stila products because there's some really good ones. I also picked up two of the glitter and glows. Again, $5 a piece for these glitter and glows. Like, are you kidding me? The two shades I picked up are Diamond Dust and Tulip Twinkle. Diamond Dust was always one I kind of had in my mind. And I bought the one from e.l.f. that's basically a dupe for this. But this one is just so pretty and I have, it's been like on my mental list for a very long time. What I like about it is it almost goes to that hollow side of silver where you can have a little pink, you have a little purple, you have a little blue in there and it just looks really pretty on the eye. Um, I'm hoping this one is not as patchy as the e.l.f. one. I have found that the e.l.f. one in the bling bling shade is a little patchy. Um, out of all the e.l.f. ones I've tried, it's actually the patchiest, and I'm hoping that this one is, like, a good, like, dupe for it, which I know sounds funny, but I paid $5 for both of them, so I'm just seeing which formula I like better. But Tulip Twinkle, I have nothing like this guy. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my gosh, it is that beautiful peachy pink, beautiful shine to it. It's got apricot shine. It's got a little orange shine. It's got that pink reflect. I'm so excited for this shadow. Um, I'm hoping that the formula is so good. I did own one of these. I owned, it's like a taupe shade. Oh, I can't remember. In my head, it's like Kitten Karma it keeps coming up, but I know that that's not the shade I had. I panned it on this channel and it went bad. I think, was it last year or two years ago I used it up? Oh my God. It's gonna come to me and I'm gonna be like, duh, Julie. <laughs> but for right now, I got Tulip Twinkle back in my collection. Super excited. These are creams, which means that they will go bad in two years. And so I'm going to make sure I use those. They're not gonna go into my like 
downstairs in my drawers. Like they're gonna go right into my makeup counter so I can continue using them ASAP. And then Ulta sent my husband, who has an Unalta account. If you have not signed up your significant other for an Ulta account, may I recommend that you do? Because sometimes they get better coupons than you do. <laughs> And I wish I was being facetious, but Ulta does send out targeted coupons to targeted customers. And he keeps getting these $10 off anything purchases. So I just keep using them because um, I want to and they're sent to me. I cannot use them with my discount. I, like at full transparency, I cannot use them with my discount. So I just purchased something that's between like $10 and $15. <laughs> use a $10 off coupon and it's better than the sale I would have had using my discount. So... What I decided to pick up is right, well, as I'm filming this, Ulta has a five for five table and it's great stocking stuffers. It's not like, it's not high end makeup. Do not think it's high end makeup, but it is really fun stuff. It's like bubble bath and nail files and that nail scrubber. You can get um, bobby pins that are decorative and you can get, like, you can get a blush, you can get an eyeshadow. I'm sure they're fine. It's by the Sweet and Shimmer brand. I don't know. I'm sure it's fine. Like, I've just never, like, been drawn to it. I don't think it's, like, great pigmentation, but I think it's fine. Um, you'll get a look out of it. And I don't think it'll be a dramatic look, but it will be a look. And I'm sure it'll be beautiful. And so I did buy some of that. It's gonna be a Christmas gift for my nieces. Um, I did keep one of the five for five, so this is technically a dollar. <laughs> This is the Sweet and Shimmer Unscented Makeup Remover Wipes. This is just a 15 pack, so yes, it is smaller than your average pack you would get from like Neutrogena. But it's also a dollar compared to what six or seven dollars from Neutrogena packs. Um, I love the fact that this year they're unscented. They have been scented in the past. So I just want to pick them up. These are normally, again, fine. I use them when I go on vacation. So I just will throw this like in my bag and I'm good to go for the week. So I wanted to pick that up. I also picked up because that's only $5 and I had to spend over, <laughs> you know, 10 at least to get the $10 off. This is the Milani Aqua Bloom Hydrate Replenish Toner with green, blue-green algae and hyaluronic acid. You guys know I picked up OC uh, the other month ago. About a, was it a month ago? Yeah, like a, two months ago, maybe a month ago. And I've really been enjoying some of their products. So I wanted to see if this was cheaper but still good because this is also algae-based. And this is... You know, my normal toners are an exfoliating toner. I picked up a hydrating one. Um, I don't know. Milani had three products with this algae in it. I didn't need any face moisturizer right now. You guys know I have like, <laughs> and you're going to see more here. I'm like, my face cannot be more moisturized than it is right now. Like, I'm doing very well with my face moisturization. Um, and the other one I think was like a cleanser. Again, something I didn't need. But toners, I actually don't have a whole back stock of toners. So I picked this one up. We'll see how it goes. And I will, I will report back and let you know what I think about it. All right, now let's talk about something I feel very passionate about, and that is using Ulta points. I love my Ulta points, and you guys know I have purchased things because of my discount plus times the points, like five times the points or whatever it is. And I, um, I, <laughs> whew, I've had a lot of points this year. <laughs> so you might remember this summer I used 2,000 points. Well, I have once again gained 2,000 points. And so I decided to use it when I saw a couple sales come up. And in particular, the early Black Friday deals that Ulta was hosting. Like the three weeks leading up to Black Friday, Ulta had on Friday, Saturday, and no, was it Friday, Saturday? Was it Thursday, Friday, Saturday? Yes, it was Thursday, Friday, Saturday. They had picked like a multiple either like products or brands to put on a special discount. And a couple weeks ago, there were two products I was extremely interested in. I had my 2,000 points, so I figured, you know what, let's just splurge on a few things. And I'm so excited on what I splurged on. So the numbers you see down here are going to be kind of crazy because you're going to be like, that's not worth that. Well, after my 2,000 points, which is $125 off, this is all I paid for the products. Like... It's amazing what happens when you use 2,000 points at Ulta. Like, Ulta just gives you this money. Like, if you use 950 points, you're going to get $86 off. If you use, what is it, did I do that right? Wait a second. If you use 1,950 points, that's what it is. 1,950 points, you're going to get $86 off. If you go to 2,000 points, you get $125 off. There's like, give you some extra money <laughs> just for funsies. Like, an extra $30, $35 just for funsies. And so... 
I took full advantage of that extra $35. Um, the first thing that was on sale that I really have wanted for the longest time and I just haven't gotten around to purchasing yet yet is a Mac product. They put Mac, the whole Mac line, 30% off. And so I picked up the Mac Mineralized Skin Finish. Yes, I realize this is old school and we don't talk about it on YouTube anymore, but it's stuck in my mind that Soft and Gentle would be the perfect product for me. <laughs> and so I picked up Soft and Gentle. This is it. It's beautiful. I tested it this morning and I do think it's actually really nice. Um, what's interesting is inside the packaging, they also gave this little like plastic dome. I thought that was interesting. This is what the product looks like. You can either use this as a targeted highlight. Just put the highlight on my highlight. And you can see it's like subtle. Or what you can do is if you use just a light fluffy brush, you can put this all over your face. And it just gives like a really nice natural glow. This is like a peach finish. Ah. Oh. It's stunning. It just gives like a little bit of life in there and you can see it's not going into my fine lines or wrinkles at all. It's just giving me like a natural glow. So I'm very excited I purchased this. I'm really excited I got 30% off this product. I'll also tell you my 25% discount for working at Ulta also worked on top of this which just brings it an amazing price. Um, so yeah, <laughs> 10 out of 10. I'm really excited I purchased that. I also decided to purchase the Way Fine Shampoo. I have having a really big, oh, excuse me, this is a conditioner. <laughs> the Fine Hair Conditioner. Um, I don't know if, well, many of you guys have already commented. So I'll just let you guys know, yes, I cut off like significant amount of my hair. My hair was not doing well. I have been trying a couple new shampoos. I've been trying like oh, so many new shampoos. And none of them were really working for me. And then I tried this Pureology Volume Shampoo, which was horrible. Horrible. I couldn't believe how bad it was for my hair. When I think of volume, I would think of something that adds a little stiffness to the hair. It tries to really, like, lift it up. It almost, like, it's like a detox, right? It, like, detox, and then it, like, lifts this volume up. I was so greasy. I was greasy, with like, as soon as I stepped out of the shower. I even did, like, the double shampoo. I, I thought I did everything right. I like used very little conditioner and it did not work at all. So I got very angry. And I just cut off my hair. And I got these highlights in it to give it a little, like, to seriously, I wanted to damage my hair to get more volume out of it, which sounds stupid, but like that's what I did. I put in these honey highlights and I chopped it off. And so I bought the Way Shampoo. This stuff is expensive. I would not normally pick this up. Wake conditioner. I keep calling it shampoo. I would not pick this up if I did not use my points. I actually needed, <laughs> I must admit, I was at like $100 like spent, and then I was like, well, I'll just pick this up so I can use the rest of my points, because again, it doesn't make sense not to use 2,000 points at a time. So I picked this up so I could like <laughs> use my points. I basically got this for free in my head. Um, now I did, you'll see like a couple of bucks down here, but we're going to see if this works for me. If this doesn't work for me, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to go back to Garnier Fructose, which is not good for your hair. But um, it works for my hair. It, it gets it clean, at least. I don't know why it's so hard to clean my fine, thin hair. You would think I'd be overstripping it, but no, I'm like super, like, I don't know. It's an issue. Um, the other thing that was on sale for this Black Friday deal was the Exuviance entire line 30% off. And I realized last month it was 30% off. But it was also 30% off this Black Friday deal. So I picked up, uh, I was introduced to this serum by a rep, and I was kind of like hemming and hawing about it. And then I just decided to go for it with the points that I had and with like the deals that were going. I was just in a shopping mood, to be honest with you. This is the Exuviance Believe Comprehensive Anti-Aging Age Reverse Total Correct and Sculpt Serum. So this firm sculpts skin's appearance, reducing visible signs of aging. I like it because it's a vitamin C and antioxidant style. Um, and it, it does like a whole bunch of different things. It's supposed to have a manophil which supports skin natural collagen, and it's supposed to leave you lightly hydrated, velvety smooth, and illuminated. Can't argue with that. Um, I did put it on my hand a couple times in the store, and my skin had never looked better on my hands, which I know sounds crazy, but like, something to think about. This is what it looks like. It is just a light peach liquid. Um, it goes on clear, and I'm really excited about it. I think Exuviance is a very underrated brand. I was actually talking to my cousin about it, who is into beauty and makeup, 
And she goes, I've never heard of Exuvians. And I was like, really? Like, Exuvians has been at Ulta for years. Um, and so I introduced her to the brand. I'm hoping she picks something up from it because I think it, you know, none of us are getting any younger and she's my older cousin. So, um, Brittany, I love you. <laughs> and I thought this just might help her. I don't know. But this is what I picked up. So I hope she does too, something similar. I told her about the sale too. Don't worry. Like, I'm not going to like send my cousin to buy something expensive. Um, without, you know, making sure she knows the good deals that are happening. The last thing that I picked up, if you do not want my advent calendar surprise ruined, <laughs> turn off the volume of this video real fast. Close your eyes. I'll be back in like two seconds. Okay. All right. The advent calendar surprise is the Clarence advent calendar. I realize that Clarence is not a brand that I know very much about. So I thought buying an advent calendar like this, while expensive, might be worth my time exploring. So this is going to be my advent calendar that I'm going to use next year. Now, this is not a 24-day calendar. You can probably guess by the size of it. It is not 20. It is a 12-day calendar. So I'm going to mix this with um, more products that are in my collection. So I'll basically do 12 days of this and then 12 days of products I already own. What I liked about this is that, first of all, they told me everything that was in it, so it's not really a surprise, but it's a mix of skincare as well as cosmetics. And I, my first Clarins Cosmetics was a lip oil. I just purchased that for the 21 Days of Beauty. Um, and I just like the fact that, it tells me everything on the back here, but it's just a mix of skincare as well as cosmetics. And I thought that was kind of fun. It's rare to find like an advent calendar within a single brand to do both of that. Um, I feel like my advent calendars have either been all skincare or all color cosmetics. So I thought this would be really fun. And it's really heavy. Now this thing is expensive, I'm not gonna lie. It wasn't like 50 bucks that I normally spend on an advent calendar. Like this thing was a chunker, but I decided to go for it. And since we're partnering things up, I used my points on it, I used my discount on it, and they had a free gift with it. I decided to go ahead and do it at this moment. Again, I'm using the points. It was all kind of like a perfect storm for this purchase. I feel like I got so much use out of it. <laughs> the first thing they had, the first free gift, there were two free gifts with this clearance purchase, was the, that's in French, um, Hydra Essential Intensive Hydrating Care. It moisturizes and quenches silky skin. Cool. I don't, again, I don't know anything about Clarence. And then, if you spent $50 in Clarence, they gave you this four-pack of more samples. The Clarence Instant Smooth Base is one. The Clarence Total Cleansing Oil with Alpine Golden Gelatin and Lemon Balm Extract. Cool. The Total Eye Lift, Lifting Replenishing Eye Concentrate in the Red Box. And the Super Restorative Day Illuminating Lifting Replenishing Cream. Again. Cool, I'm excited about that. I, you can't say no to that. Um, so in all, that was what I used my 2,000 points on, as well as my 25% discount, as well as the Black Friday deals of 30% off, both the Mac and the Exuvians. Um, and then, of course, because I bought it online, I got a pack full of free stuff. Because <laughs> even though you use your points online, if you spend over the certain amount, they'll still give you the free gift. So this is the bag I chose. It's pink. I actually really dislike this bag. I'm not gonna lie. It looks like a winter coat, so I get the theming. It is very highly metallic. This is not gonna be staying with me. We're gonna move this on to a better home. <laughs> but yeah, that's uh, a thing. It is, was filled with samples. I don't think this is the bag I picked, to be honest with you. <laughs> well, this is the color of the bag I picked, but the things that were inside were not things I would pick out. So I'm going to show you the things that I don't want um, because I don't want them. And I'm actually going to put them back in the bag and give them to somebody who do, does want them. And I'll show you the things I am going to keep, which is why I, I know that, like, <laughs> I don't think I chose this bag. But again, it was free. I'm not complaining. Um, the Curlsmith Hold Me Softly Style Balm for curly hair. I don't have curly hair. That's going to go away. Um, the Philosophy Amazing Grace Ballet Rose. That's not a scent that I am drawn to. Neither is the Gucci Bloom scent. Um, then I have the Clean It Zero Vanilla Balm Cleanser. Uh, I can't use balm cleansers. They irritate my eyes. Although, 
I understand that that one in particular is really good. Like a lot of people who I work with like that one. I just, it's not drawing to me. Um, the Boing Benefit Concealer, the Tarte Shape Tape little packet thing. I already know what shade I am and I already know that I like it, so I don't feel like I need to try that one again. The MAC Three Red Lipstick Little Lip Sampler. I actually think this is a cute, like, little add-on, but I don't need it. The Living Proof Perfect Hair Day 501 Styling Treatment. Um, I, I've given that away multiple times. That is like, I feel like that's the number one free gift that Living Proofs gives you. If it's not in this type of packet form, it's in like the little, little squeezy tube one. I, I get these all the time. I don't think it's a bad product. Again, I'm just not interested in trying it. I already have tried it. And then the Beach Waver & Co. Blonde Purple Shampoo and Purple Conditioner. I am just not blonde, uh, but I think this is actually, again, a really good sampler. I didn't know Beach Waver did shampoo, so I'm very intrigued by this to see if they have other shampoos and conditioners I might be interested in, but um, I, I, don't, I don't really want hair, so I don't need that. So boom, this is gonna go to somebody else. The samples I am keeping, um, the Joyco, the Joy of Healthy Hair, Defy and Damage, and I, I would never have picked the sample, but like, that's like a really nice sample. There are four guys in there. You got the shampoo, conditioner, protective mask, and protective shield. I don't know. Maybe it's good. I've never tried anything from Joyco. Um, the other big full-size product in here is the Mega Babe Antibacterial Wipes. Um, I'm not saying this is a bad gift. I just don't know if I would have chosen antibacterial wipes. <laughs> I like the Mega Bag Stick Balm for In Between My Legs. Um, I didn't even know they made antibacterial wipes, so I, I'm sure we sell this. I like, now that I see the packaging, I'm like, maybe we do sell this in my store, but it's not everything I'm like, pull for. So I guess I'm glad I got it for free. <laughs> I don't know. Again, a Clarins product. This is the Reboot Refreshing Hydrating Cream. I'm gonna know so much about Clarins by the end of this. This is my fifth. No, this is my sixth Clarins sample, not including the advent calendar, um, that I got just right now in this <laughs> shipment. Um, the fragrances I am going to keep is the Valentino Born in Roma. This fragrance goes from feeling really good on me to really not good on me, so I want to give it a try. Like, every time I spray it on myself in the store, like, I feel like it smells really good, but then sometimes I think it smells really bad. So I want to give that sample a try and see what I like. I have already purchased this one. <laughs> <laughs> the Angel Nova Moogler scent. So I'm very excited to have a small size of that. And then I'm also keeping the Ellis Brooklyn Sweet Eau de Parfum. I have never smelled this, so I thought it might be worth giving it a try because I like sweet fragrances in general. All right, more foil packets. I thought this was supposed to be like a 16 sample packet, but I feel like I got so many more than 16. So again, not complaining. I'm very happy to get free products. I just don't think it was the one I picked. <laughs> <laughs> the Bobbi Brown Hydrating Eye Cream, because none of these samples look familiar to me. Like, this, out of everything so far, this is the one I would have been excited about trying. Like, this one would have, like, drawn me in to pick, choose the package, but I don't remember seeing this as a choice. The Kate Somerville Retinol Power Serum. Didn't even know we sold Kate Somerville, but I'm excited about trying that one. Um, a Dermalogica Fragrance Intensive Moisture Balance. I, we give these away all the time in my Ulta. So I'm excited to have that one. I I think I've tried that before. I think it's pretty good. I forget. It's Dermalogica to me has like a few standout products, but I don't think that's one of them that like has really stood out to help my skin. The Jack Black Performance Remedy Turbo Wash. I'll give this to Keith to see whatever he wants to do with it. The Buttershop Almond Milk. Little sample, little lotion. These smell good. I think the almond milk actually smells good as well. The NYX, the Marshmallow Primer. This sells a lot at our store and I haven't tried it yet. I think I've got a little sample of it, but it, I haven't tried it yet. And then the Good Molecules Silicone Free Priming Moisturizer. Again, this is one I probably would have picked out. Um, so, so far we've got two that I would have picked out. <laughs> and then the Whey Medium Hair Shampoo and Conditioner. Ironically, we got a Whey sample in here. I probably would have picked out these three, but normally when I pick one of these sample packs, I make sure there's at least seven in there that I'm interested in. So... Well, I am keeping more than seven. These are the seven that like I would want to try as samples. The other ones are just kind of like bonus samples, which is why I'm a little like, did I pick this one? I don't know. 
I don't know if I picked it or not. But I am excited to try some new products. Like those three in particular are really going to interest me. I'll use the antibacterial wipes. I'll try the fragrances. We'll see what happens here. <sighs> and that's all my shopping, you guys. Really, November is the time to shop. I get the best deals now. I didn't pay full price for a single thing that I picked up, and I'm so excited about it. Also, I use my points. I'm so excited about that. I love to get a discount and use my points together. So, your turn. Tell me what you think. What did I purchase that's your favorite product? Have you tried any of these? What do you feel about sample packages? Do you like getting sample packages or do they just sit around doing nothing in your life? Um, is it something that you reach for constantly or is it something you don't reach for? Why or why not? Just why are your minds want to know? We've already kind of discussed what draws you in, but did something I talk about draw you in to make a purchase? Like, do you like using your points with a discount? Do you prefer doing something more like using your points and getting like five times the points at the same time? Many of you mentioned that that works really well for you, like the five times the points, the 10 times the points, the eight times the points, the three times the points. Um, for me, I would say that's my least favorite way, unless it's 10 times the points. If it's 10 times the points, I'm definitely making a purchase because that to me is worth it. But if it's five times the point, I'm like, eh, if I partner with something else, I might be interested, but I probably wouldn't do just five times the points on its own unless there's something I was already going to buy. I don't know. I don't know. I'd rather get something like a discount, like an immediate discount rather than a discount on a future purchase. Just personal preference. Let's go through some gratis because I do have quite a few gratis products coming up. Um, most of these came from representatives because now that COVID, um, at least in Tennessee, is affecting less and less of daily life and daily living, we've all kind of like, become accustomed to it, wearing masks, you know, like, you know, the representatives of cosmetic companies are coming back out to Ulta and they're doing some more education with us and they're teaching us a lot more. So let me go through some things that have been going on there. Here, first, Juice Beauty Rep, thank you, Nicole, for these lovely gifts. Um, they had an event with us actually, and so I picked up two samples from them. One is the Juice Beauty Stem Cellular Replenishing Oil. I love it because it's organic. It's just a little vial in there, but I'm excited to give this a try and see what I think about it. I also have the Hydrating Gel Moisturizer from Juice Beauty. And Julie, you might be like, Julie, um, a gel moisturizer? What are you doing? I know. I actually didn't realize this was gel when I asked like to try it and when she offered it to me. Um, I'm going to give it a try still. Maybe this gel one is really good. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but, you know, organic brand, something that I need to know more about. So... Uh, I've tried Juice Beauty in the past. I haven't found a product that I really love from it, but I know they've been reformulating and getting more and more products, like expanding their line. So I'm excited to try these two and see what I think about it. Oh yeah, she also gave me the two-in-one cleanser. I think I've tried this one before. I don't, I don't really remember, to be honest with you. Um, then Stila came by to say hi, and Stila gave me the Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner Pencil. Nope, just liner, so it's the pen. Um, I got it in the shade Intense Black. It's just a little guy, just a little guy like that. But these normally last me a good while. I already know I like this product, so I was very excited when Clyde, thank you Clyde, gave this to me. Um, and I learned a lot about Stila, which is why I know that like, there are some discounts coming on Stila. <laughs> all right, then we have a Clinique rep that works with us at Ulta all the time. He's there full time. His name is Alan, Alan is awesome. His boss came in to do some training with Holiday for him. And they gave a bunch of the people on staff some gifts just to like thank us for supporting Clinique all year long, which I thought was very nice. And he gave me the Clinique My Happy Cookies and Kisses Eau de Parfum. I love this scent, which I know is so different from my normal world of scent because this actually has a little spice to it. But I think when you first spray it, and this is just like the little like sprayer size, it's a uh, 0.5 fluid ounce. It smells like sugar cookies and then it develops into this spicy gingerbread. Oh my God, it smells so fascinating. And I'm not really a spicy gal normally with my perfumes, but there's just something about this that's really special and unique. And I love it this time of year. And I think Alan knows that because I show this to every guest who comes into my Ulta because I'm absolutely obsessed with it. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm excited about this and I thank you. Thank you, Alan, for giving that to me. And thank you for Alan's boss. I forgot her name right now, but 
the regional manager of Clinique for Tennessee. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. All right, Exuviance rep. She gave me the Achieve Lift Volumizing Concentrate Triple Hyaluronic Acid. Okay, so this one has three different types of hyaluronic acid to infuse skin with volumizing hydration designed to encourage youthful, natural-looking firmness and a more lifted look. I'm excited to try this with the one that I picked out for myself. I actually got this after I ordered this. So, um... She didn't have that one yet to give me a, as gratis, which is totally understandable, and I'm super excited to try this one, too, to kind of compare them. This is another serum-based product, and it looks like this. Isn't it interesting? It is a plastic tube, and you push this down, and it kind of comes out that way for hyaluronic acid. Is hyaluronic acid uh, susceptible to sun, which I figured why this would be in a dark casing I don't know but you're supposed to apply it twice a day and I'm so excited about this I thought this would be really fun to play with as well um I feel like I've been totally spoiled do you guys ever feel like that like I don't know if any of you work in the beauty industry or in another industry but when I was in the nonprofit world you guys know I've worked in museums multiple multiple times um people just don't like give you stuff like <laughs> and I realize this is for training and education but it's really nice to say, like, hey, Julie, we realize you've been working really hard with our brands and helping us, you know, like, sell them and, like, find the guests that would benefit most from these products. Let me give you something to show that, like, we appreciate you and you can try something new to see, like, is this good or who is it good for? Like, who would this work best for? It's just really nice. In the nonprofit world, I feel like you don't get that. You're working for, like, a different mission instead of, like, making... Like, I feel like the mission of Ulta, which I know is not their official mission, because, like, I think their official mission is, like, to be the best love destination for all things beauty. <laughs> um, the, to my, my personal goal when I work at Ulta is to make people feel like the most beautiful, authentic selves. Like, that's my goal, is to be the most beautiful, authentic selves. And I love the fact that I'm able to try something for free, which I would never be able to afford on its own, to, like see who this would help make feel beautiful and so because everyone's already beautiful when they come in by the way no matter what you look like or what you feel like you are beautiful when you walk through those doors i just want you to help i just want to help you bring out your own beauty that's that's really my goal so i'm excited to try this <sighs> i feel like there's really long i'm sorry but like i've been feeling something about alta lately because i just feel so like blessed to be working with like a great group of people so I'm sorry. <laughs> benefit! You guys know last Christmas I won a big benefit contest. This year I'm not, um, as a manager, I'm not competing in that contest again because I feel like that wouldn't be fair, um, nor is it my place to do so. But I will encourage everyone else to. But I did help sell a few products and as a show of um, support on our benefit brow gal, she gave me the professional super setter long-lasting makeup setting spray um and you might be like julie your name's written on all this yes it is <laughs> yes it is this is how we know that these products are designed for a particular person um and then my manager will sign it out at the bottom so i'm very excited about this this is their setting spray they came out with this summer i haven't tried it yet people seem to be raving about it like she tells every bone of her guests about this product and a bunch of people are constantly repurchasing it so I'm excited to give this a try. It says all mist, no mess. Uh, all mist, no mess. No drops, spots, or stickiness. Mist on a smooth, even feather like cloud. I'm very excited about this to see if that actually works. It's supposed to like smooth your skin, so hey. <laughs> and then I got to choose one piece of gratis myself. Um, and what I ended up choosing was the First Aid Beauty Facial Radiance Pads. I got it in the travel size again. I have picked this out before, and I will pick this out forevermore. <laughs> this is, my, I think, my third one. I just love this stuff. This is just a little travel size. Um, how many pads are in here? 28 pads. Um, I go through them about every other month. I get an empty. I'm almost done with the second one that I've used up, so I wanted to make sure I had a backup. I just love this stuff. I think it's really good. This is the way I normally tone, so I am excited to try my new toner that I mentioned before, the Milani one. Um, this is my exfoliating one. This is going to be my hydrating one. We're going to see what happens there. 
And that, my friends, is my end. I know this is a huge, long video. I really appreciate you sticking here with me. Um, I just feel, I feel very excited moving forward and I feel very grateful on all the opportunities I've had this year to move forward and to grow and to learn. And I'm just super excited about everything. It's a great time to be alive. It's a great time to learn. And it's a great time to be in the cosmetics industry. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Happy panning, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.